In this Python exercise, we will calculate the greatest common divisor of a number. So what is the greatest common desired divisor? So if we have two numbers like 24 and 36, GCD is the greatest number or the biggest number that divides both of these two. So in this case, the greatest common divisor is 12 because no number greater than 12 divides 24 and 36 both. So 12, 24, 12, 3, 36. So 13 divides, 13 does not. 18 divides 36, but 18 does not divide 24. So the greatest common divisor is 12. Now we will use a very interesting feature that is tuple assignment. And let's get started. Okay, first we can easily import math and calculate GCD. So let's say A equals to 24, B equals to 36, right? And if we use math, we can just do math dot gcd and pass these two variables and run this and it will be calculated but this is not how we'll, how we will do this because it's the easy stuff we need to use euclidean algorithm so let's see how we can do that now if you run this the output is 12 so we can easily calculate using this gcd function but it does not help us much when we are learning to code so we will use euclidean algorithm to calculate gcd now you can learn what euclidean algorithm is it's just a method to calculate GCD okay it's not related to programming it's a mathematical concept so we don't need math for that we will calculate the GCD ourselves first let's say we have again let's say we have 12 and we have B equals to 36 right and let's create a function to calculate GCD we'll take two numbers uh, let's say num one comma num two and what we do is this is called tuple assignment first we do num 1 comma num 2 equals to num 2 comma num 1 percentage num 2 now you know what percentage means that is it divides number 1 by number 2 and it gives out the remainder so what we are doing here is we are assigning number two to number one and then we are assigning number one and number two's remainder when we divide number one and number two what is the remainder that remainder to number two but how long we need to do it we need to do it in a loop until our number two becomes zero so while number two this means that until number two is not zero that is this is not zero we keep repeating this now how does this work Let's just print, print it and let's see how it works. So let's print num1, let's print num2, and after we do this, let's see, okay, let's print here. And let's print here. After modulus and then again we will print these two. Now this is nothing but this is Euclidean algorithm. So this is just Euclidean algorithm. This is how we can do it in code. Now let's run this and let's see what happens. Uh, let me just return from one. This will be the GCD. So for now let's just print GCD of a and B is okay. Let's calculate this first. And we are using F strings here, and by now you should be very proficient in using F strings. Let's run this. So as you can see, it is saying GCD of 12 and 13 is 12, and that is the case. 12 is the greatest common divisor of both these two things. Now, initially, as you can see here, and this is a very important method in understanding anything. You can just add print statements and see what's happening on in your code. So first, we have 12 and 36, right? After modulus, what has happened is we have 36 and 12. So num1 has become 36, and num2 has become 12, because that's what's happening here. We are assigning num2 to num1. And in num2, we are assigning num1 modulus num2, that is 12 modulus 36. The remainder will be 12. And again, 
we are starting with this now when we start with 36 and 12 here we have 36 and 12 what happens is number one is 36 number two is 12 so 36 becomes 12 and what is number two number two becomes number one divided by number two what is number number one number one was 36 and uh, when we divide 36 by 12 what is the remainder remainder is zero so next time when we come here while zero that means that this loop will not run and we will come to this return statement and finally that number one that is 12 here is our gcd so this is how you can calculate gcd if you have any questions let me know in the comments below